So for this week's Trades of the Week, we're going to take a look back at the opportunities that have, I guess, hit target really over the last uh, week or so. And it's been a very, very good week for the end of day FX markets, which we tend to focus in uh, for these Trades of the Week videos. Now, I'm starting off with New Zealand Swiss, which was, I guess, really the only opportunity that's moved with the trend. Um, so downtrend on uh, New Zealand Swiss uh, really since sort of mid last year. And the market from there giving us a short, allowing us from the 25th of March, actually look for more points than we might do otherwise. Uh, typically, when we go against the trend, we're looking for 100 point targets. When we go with the trend, we're looking for a bit more. In this case, we're looking for 249 points. Now, I won't go into exactly how we work it out and so on in this video, but you can see here how the market from 72.91 went through and hit that target zone uh, on the 1st of May. So, Set and forget, yes, the market went against us for a little while, but it didn't take out our stop loss. It did accelerate through to target and a very nice profit of 249 points. Now, at £3 a point, which is fairly achievable, uh, really, that's the best part of £750 profit just from that one trade alone. Now, looking through at uh, some of the other ones, uh, Aussie New Zealand uh, triggering also a couple of weeks ago. That went on very nicely to hit target last week as well. So, just 100 points on this one. 101.60 from the 9th of April there, going on and hitting target quite generously. Again, pulling back initially, but going on to hit that uh, target there for again a nice healthy profit in this case 100 points and again three pound a point that's 300 pounds of profit there just from looking at the markets just once a night really that's all it is We're not talking about huge time pressures at all New Zealand Swiss, uh, uh, sorry, Euro Swiss rather, uh, giving us a buy here back on the 22nd of April, 104.15. Again, just 100 points, heavily downtrend on Euro, uh, Euro Swiss at the moment. So just 100 points there, which will make the target 105.15. You can see here just a few days ago, hitting a high of 105.23. So again, moving about 108 points, moving very nicely through to that target zone. With your target in place, with your spread betting or CFD FX platform, you're taking those profits there on that as well. Euro New Zealand, we had a buy here on the 23rd of April. Obviously, you can see that's an aggressive buy. Just look at the clarity of that signal there as those indicators turn from red to green. Close of this day here, 23rd of April, 142.43. And here we can see the market some 500 points higher. Again, a significant profit on this market. And we're just going to round it off really with a look at the Bund. Perhaps not a market that a lot of you will trade. However, it does tend to move relatively well. And it is one of the list of 38 markets that we take our track record from. 159.14 was the entry point there on the 22nd of April and here we can see a significantly lower another 100 points taken on this one all in all just so you know uh, that was a profit just taken on those five trades alone of 649 points you do that at three pounds a point and that's best part of two thousand pounds just taken from five trades work and as I said earlier you can do this with literally ten 20 minutes an evening. A very healthy uh, profit taken on a lot of markets there over the last week or two. That's this week's Trades of the Week. Hopefully more of the same next week as well. If you would like more information about trading the right way, TrendSignal is giving you the opportunity to see and hear about its services live at a free online seminar. Take a look at the TrendSignal website for the latest events and to book your free place.